What's up Toxic Nation, welcome back to my channel, my name is Toxic and what I have for you today is a new Black Ops 3 video in which I'll be giving you the best class setup currently for the Man of War and uh, let's jump right into it, as you can see I'm using a Varric site and the reason why is because recently the Varric and the Recon sites uh, got a secret buff um, also the BOA3 site so basically right now the Varric site is your best shot for reducing recoil it really does a great job basically they they sped up the center speed which basically tells the uh the, the game when to or uh, how fast to move the red dot in the middle of the barracks to the center so when you're shooting you know the red dot moves all over the place because of recoil center speed uh determines how fast the red dot returns to the center so you can uh keep aiming down the sights um, and so forth. So you want to use the Varric site. It's, it's working pretty well. You don't want to stack it with Fulgrip, however, because it will just cancel out the effects for some reason. Uh, that's I don't know why they did it that way. That's just how it is. You cannot use both of them at the same time. So go with the Varric site, which gives you more recoil reduction than the Fulgrip at this moment. And you know the Man of War still is you know, a very competitive very uh, good assault rifle even when I was playing back the, uh, on the closed beta I remember this gun was so good and I was using it throughout the beta still to this day it's a very very strong assault rifle so after the barracks I went ahead and put on a rapid fire because you want to increase the fire rate this gun has a very slow rate of fire and the only way to increase it is to put on rapid fire I was also running uh, extended mags you know you want to have more bullets in that clip especially when you don't have quick mags because this will save you from having to reload every other 10 seconds uh, and after that what you want to put is quick draw again I always use quick draw you should always too because you want to have that competitive advantage over your enemies when it comes to aiming down the sights faster so those are the attachments that are put on this gun let's go for the perks I basically always run the same perks almost for every class. I was running Six Sense, with which you already know what that does. Um, I was running what was uh, Fast Mag, not not Fast Mag, sorry. I was running um, Fast Hands, which again aimed down the sights faster after sprinting. And finally, I was running Blast Suppressor, so I could jump around with no problem, stay off the mini map, suppress the thruster sounds, etc. You guys know the deal. So that's basically the class setup for the Man of War. And as you can see in the gameplay, I was just melting people left and right. I was doing really well. So you guys go ahead and try this class setup. And let me know in the comments below how you think it does. Does it work for you? Does it not work for you? Again, the Man of War is still a competitive assault rifle. It is still one of the best assault rifles to use in this game. You probably don't want to use it in maps like Nuke Town because it's a very small map and you can't really rush with this gun. Uh, but you can use it in maps like this one, which is Breach. You know, those mid-size, large-size maps, you're going to do well with this with this class, I promise you that. So go ahead and equip the Varric Sight, the Rapid Fire, Extended Mags, and Quick Draw on this weapon. And go jump into a lobby and tell me how you do. Let me know in the comments below. If you think this is a good class for you, if it didn't work and you have a better class, let me know also in the comments below. But yeah, my name is Toxic. Thank you for tuning in to another one of my videos. Follow me on Twitter at ToxicArtix and I will see you in the next video. And of course, Toxic out. <laughs>